What is up you guys, Rydog54 bringing you another IRL card video today. All right, we got another eBay mail day today. This is gonna be our biggest one yet by far as value goes, plus just the, uh, the quantity is insane. I have 10 packages here and some of them are really heavy. All right, so we have 10 packages. I'm gonna start with the smaller ones first. I don't think I have that many bulk orders. So I think people just package them in bigger envelopes. We're gonna start with the smaller ones here. I'm just gonna jump right into it. Try to go as quickly as possible. First card. Juan Soto rookie debut, and there's a second card in here. I believe this is his update. Let's see. Hey, he threw in an extra Juan Soto. Threw in an extra Juan Soto for me there. And then we do indeed have the update. I'm going to be taking a pretty good look at these things. Because I bought these to be graded. It looks okay. Who knows? Probably like a PSA 9. I don't really care. Juan Soto Tops Update rookie card is going to be worth a lot one day. Regardless of grade, obviously 10 is the goal, but I think I I don't think I paid more than like $28 for any of my updates. Second one, Eloy Jimenez rookie refractor autograph out of Tops Finest. I don't like that he put the team bag on backwards but you know it protects it looks nice auto is perfect happy with that next package got a nice filler card let's see what lies behind it rookie card looks like we have the bellinger update I wanted to get a couple more of these. I, I pulled a few of these in 2017 when I first started collecting. But the update Acuna, Soto, Bellingers have just been exploding this year. So I've been trying to get a couple more of them. Um, top left corner looks a little scuffed, but nothing terrible. Again, I'm going to submit most of these for grading if they... If I don't think they're going to get PSA 10s, I'm just going to keep them in their top loaders, you know? Be worth something regardless. I did not pay a lot for these. I think every one of these I put an offer down. I don't think I hit buy now on any of these and paid what that buyer was asking. Next package up, we have... All right, this is my one prospect for this video. I think it's the only one. I got this for literally two bucks. Jeremiah Jackson. As looked in the picture, perfect centering. Rookie or uh, Bowman's first refractor. This dude blew up for the Angels last year. Absolutely broke out. I think he's going to be a stud. He plays shortstop too. So very excited about this guy. I think he hit like 20 home runs last year or something as a middle infielder. That's big in the minors. Okay, see how Okay, see how small this packaging is? <laughs> this thing weighs like three pounds. Let's see what it says on the label. Four ounces my ass. I don't know how I got here because this thing's definitely over four. I wish I had my scale on me right now. Way over four. All right, he tied this one freaking down. All right, what lies in here? I had an idea of what it was. So I figured it was some Eloy stuff. I didn't buy this, so he threw this in, which is cool, I guess. This is his his very first Bowman card. The auto of this is what you really want. And I believe he threw this in as well. Wow, okay. So this is a... Top Series 2 Eloy. I did not buy this. 
unless I bought this from the exact same person. Because I know I did buy one of these. So maybe, maybe I bought from the same person. I'd have to look at that. But Top Series 2 Eloy, that's going to be one that excels in value among the rest. You got a couple filler cards here. Yelich, Beltre, Judge League Leaders, Future Stars Judge with Rookie Cup. That's not bad. Mankata Future Stars, Cody Bellinger Rookie Cup Future Stars. Two people I collect, so shout-outs to that dude. Shout-outs to that guy. I'll take those. And these should all be the same... And these are tops complete set. It's from the complete set. So it's not like crazy value to them, but these are image variations. So if you look at, if you look up any of the Eloy cards, like the update, it's a very similar picture to this, but he's swinging more down on the ball rather than coming through it. So I got one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine of them. Very happy about this purchase. I just, I, I was trying to get a couple image variations of Eloy, and this seemed like a popular one. And I didn't pay that much for it. I think I paid like maybe like 30 bucks, maybe less than that even. I, I can't remember. But I was very happy with that purchase. I am very happy with all these purchases, guys. This is by far my favorite mail day. I think we're just getting started too. We've already had we've already had a Bellinger update. We've had a Soto update. We've had an Eloy rookie auto. We're looking good. Very excited about those. Some image variations of Eloy. Oh. This guy package just went up pretty deep, but I think we made it to the card. What do we got here? All right, here's another Eloy. I think it's only one card. I can't remember if there's one or two. It's a, this is another image variation. This is a legit Topps Chrome image variation. Um, the original Topps Chrome looks just like the Series 2. The Topps Chrome looks just like that, but it's Chrome. So that's the image. This is the image variation. It's also a refractor. I don't know if they made base of it, but it's a refractor as well. So very happy about that pickup. Again, I wanted to pick up a couple image variations of Eloy because he is probably now my biggest PC. Close to it. Cards-wise, probably yes. Value-wise, maybe not. <coughs> All right, next package. We have some throw-in cards. Look at that. That's a cute little EV button sticker. Camera focus for me. Hey, there it is. It's cute. All right. What did we get in here? We have a lot of cards, so I have no idea what's in this. This might have been from a break I was in. Who's this from? I think I know who it's from. All right. If you're on, if you're, if you guys like breaking cards, uh, break with my boy Banff Breakers over at twitch.tv slash Banff Breakers. B A M F breakers. I had a feeling it was his because of that EV sticker. They always throw some fun stuff on there for, for the packaging. So my gypsy queen law, I forget what teams I had. I actually hit a bounty with this card. It was number 24, 25. And that got me this Nico Horner auto. This is actually a fun break. I only paid like, I think like 40 bucks to get in this or something, maybe 50. But it was fun because I got a lot of cards and a lot of players I've wanted. I got Will Wilson to 10 as well as this is who I was really excited about just because I'm a Dimebacks fan. So the number one draft pick and this is also numbered 10. Blake Walston, he's nasty. Chris Bryant out of Gypsy Queen, number to 99 Chrome. And then just more Gypsy Queen cards. So I'm not going to go take the time to go through those. But hit up Banff Breakers on Twitch, guys. It's a... Uh, it's a lot of fun in there. He's a really good dude. If you ever just want to be educated on the sports card game, like he's great for it because he he appreciates a lot of things that most breakers don't. Like he loves refractors more than anything in the world, and other people just flip right through them like they're nothing. So, I'll definitely teach you how to appreciate cards, which I which 
really got me into it probably the most. I broke with him the most at the start of my career. I don't do as much breaking anymore, but I do it for funsies every once in a while if I have some extra money. Next up, we have a single card. So that guy did throw in a, a top series two because this is the single I bought. Again, top series two Eloy. I didn't do any series two this year and I'm kind of bummed about it because the no number of lad was in it and the uh, series two Eloy seems to be the, the one to get. So I was kind of bummed I didn't do that. Maybe I just didn't see it or something. I don't know. I don't really get super excited about series two most of the time, but I guess I got to look for it next year. We got two more packages here. <coughs> Some bubble wrap. Oh, tape and bubble wrap just does not go together. All right, I think I know what this is, just because I can kind of see it. But got an, uh, n we have another Juan Soto update rookie i'm obsessed with juan soto so his stuff's just a little more expensive than eloy so that's why i buy eloy a little more frequently but this one looks very clean right corner might not be perfect top right corner but looks very nice for the most part those stock cards are not easy to get perfect Like, unless you pull that thing straight out of a pack, top load it, and send it off to get graded, like, there's a chance that thing's going to get messed up. This new package is thing in just, like, a giant envelope, so. What do we got here? It's got a little, little girth to it. It's got a little, little poundage. It's got multiple cards in here. I definitely didn't buy a Luis Severino Future Stars with rookie card. So we threw that in. I'll give that to my girlfriend. She's a Yankees fan. Another Juan Soto Tops update. And then I guess he threw in a Justin Turner patch from Tier 1. So let's pull everything back on the screen really quick. How does this Juan Soto look? Looks pretty good. So we got three Juan Soto updates. I paid anywhere from 23 to like $28, I think, for those, which isn't bad because graded PSA 10, they're over 100 bucks. I'm not sure. One of them for sure probably isn't going to be a 10, but maybe two of them will be. Again, I don't really care. These are going to appreciate no matter what. Like that, that's the Juan Soto card to get. We bought one top series two Eloy, but one was also thrown in. I have a couple of these coming in my next video. Spoiler alert. Because I wanted to get a few of them. We got a ton of image variations. I don't know what he did to these top loaders to make them stick. Oh, there's tape on this side. Didn't even see it. We got a bunch of image variation Eloy rookies from the complete set. Threw in his original Bowman's card with it. Image variation Eloy, Jeremiah Jackson, Refractor, Bellinger update, rookie. Happy for that because uh, for if you guys didn't know, I played against Bellinger for more than 10 years. So I like collecting him. He's a good guy. Eloy, rookie auto. And then we have the rookie debut Soto, which isn't a bad pickup. I bought that and the update for, I think, less than 30 bucks. I think that was the most I paid was 28, and I think it was for this and the update. And then he threw in a refractor out of Bowman Platinum. So really happy with this. Again, this, was, this is going to be one of my more expensive days. I, uh, I definitely splurged a little bit on these update rookies. But these are going to appreciate big time. I, uh, this is my, easily my biggest investment day. So very happy with that. So if you guys like this video, leave me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. Let me know who you guys are investing in. If you guys thought I did a good job with my eBay pickups this week. 
We're going to have some new stuff coming on the channel for cards and MLB The Show this upcoming week. So check it out. And you guys have a great rest of your day. See you.